Cooper and Cassius Fry from London we're in Stratford today for Frank Warren's announcement of a link up with the Copper Box, uh, the arena here in Stratford, and also the announcement of Billy Joe Saunders versus John Ryder on the 21st of September at that venue, fighting on the bill, hopefully for his first title. Yep. Frank Bullioni, how are you, Frank? Yeah, good, thanks, Coogan. Good to see you, mate. Yeah, very smart today, Frank. Well, this is it. Going there uh, for the press conference, got to start dressing up now. And who are you wearing today? Um, just Jaeger. <laughs> <laughs> not the uh, not Daniele style yet. No, no, definitely not. <laughs> now, <coughs> this is not weird for you, but you, this Southern Area title shot will come on the back of what happens, obviously, on July the twentieth. So, is that just a bit of added pressure for you? Um, not really, because I won't I won't look too far ahead. I'll t I'll take the next fight. Um, July twentieth is the most important, which you you always go. So, um, no, I'll, I'll be training hard for that, um, staying in good shape. And um, yeah, what happens after that? Then I'll I'll sit down and discuss with uh, Mark and uh, Frank Warren. Is it good though that you've got like potential back-to-back -back dates, more, more almost on top of each other? First in July, then a couple, two or three months later in September. Yeah, of course, because I uh, can't get too out of shape in uh, in July, then can I? So um, you can't go to Ibiza, can you? Well, that's it. Can't can't go away. But um, no, I'll have I'll have some time off after the July 20th fight, and then get back in camp nice and fresh. You, you um, don't want to go stale by doing um, too long, so I'll make sure that I rest properly and and go again and get ready for the September. I know you've uh, been on some shows that have, you know had to be postponed and you know frustrated through that obviously. But um, are you happy with the way you are, uh, the way you've progressed up until this point in your career? Yeah, the the postponements are um, are more of a an upset to the fans because that they, all the travel arrangements they're making and sort of booking time off work and all that sort of thing so there's a lot of I feel I feel sorry for the fans but as a, as a fighter I've just got to get on with it that's that's my job and um, I'm waiting for that payday so when he gets put off it's obviously a disappointment but take a bit of time off and then go again so um, it, it doesn't it doesn't really affect me too much and um, Mark, Mark and Jimmy are very experienced so they know how to get you through those things and um, no, you just get ready for the date when it when it comes. How do you feel about fighting at the Copper Box, which is somewhere over there? We haven't located it from where we are, but how do you feel about fighting there? Well, um, I'm being told that it's a, it's a sort of an upscale version of your call, so over the moon with that. Yeah, yeah, upscale version of your call. I've never been there myself. I've seen it on the telly, but I've not actually been there. So I've I've only seen sort of um, pictures on the internet of it, of the interior, but um, I haven't seen it myself. But um, yeah. East End of London, um, stone throw from Repton where I trained as an amateur, stone throw from uh, Cannon Town where I train now as a pro, so it's, um, it's ideal for me. All right. What else have you been up to, Frank, anything? Uh, to be honest with you, Cougar, I was pretty... Uh, Modelling career on hold? Modelling careers on hold and uh, just focusing on the boxing, just yeah. doing some learning, doing some good hard sparring and um, yeah, just m working my way towards uh, that, that title shot. All right, well listen, thank you very much for talking to I from London. Thanks, and uh, listen, we look forward to, firstly, at Wembley on the 20th and then on to September to see you in your first title fight. It's nice to see that, to be honest, because we followed you from your first fight, yep. progression on to Southern Area, then, you, you yeah. know. Well, it'll be almost two years, so um, I think that's that's the right sort of timing. Um, injury and illness free, I've been, been fortunate, so um, training's, gone, training's gone well and progress has, has um, followed suit, so I'll be, be ready for that Southern Area shot. Nice one. Right, this is Coogan Cassis with Frank Bullioni for Rye Film London. Thank you very much.